This year, uh, Christmas celebrations are canceled in Bethlehem, and for obvious reasons, uh, it's impossible to celebrate while our people in Gaza are going through a genocide, when children are being uh, massacred in such a brutal manner. Uh, all the heads of churches in Jerusalem uh, decided that Christmas celebrations will be mainly uh, prayers uh, with no uh, festive celebrations. Uh, we thought of what does meaning of Christmas for us as Palestinians and what message do we want to send to the world about the meaning of Christmas uh, today. So we came up with this uh, idea of a manger in the midst of a rubble resembling uh, a destroyed house in Gaza and uh, the child Jesus uh, as a child was under uh, the rubble. Uh, we've seen so many images of children being pulled out of the rubble and to us this is a message that uh, Jesus identifies with our suffering. He is in solidarity with those who are oppressed. He is in solidarity uh, with those uh, suffering. So it's a message of comfort and hope to us. But it's also a message to the world that this is what Christmas looks like in Bethlehem. Uh, with, uh, this is what Christmas looks like in Palestine. With occupation, with destruction, with the bombardment of children. Uh, while the world is celebrating, our children are under the world rubble. Uh, while the world is celebrating, our families are displaced and their homes are destroyed. So this is Christmas to us uh, in Palestine.